Scoop said, ask Scott if Spurrier is a, a hard ass off camera or what kind of coach was he? Is it, <laughs> was it different behind the lines? Um, the best part about Coach Spurrier is he, he, you know, his sarcasm, his wit, his zingers, in my opinion, they were designed to protect the current players on the team. And, and you know, yes, he would be sarcastic, and yes, he would pop you and make his one-liners and what have you, but you, we always knew he had our back. We sure. always knew, even to this day, I saw Coach Spurrier and his wife Jerry at a, our 25-year anniversary event uh, this past season, and it was phenomenal. He's just a wonderful human being, great people. Uh, they, they try to build us into good men, to good, to good leaders, to good people, and that's what he's all about. He's a wonderful person, and uh, behind closed doors, uh, I really felt like his forward persona with the media and the things, the barbs he would say toward our rivals, Free Shoes University, and you can't, <laughs> spell, you can't spell citrus without UT and all that fun stuff. That was all, you know, kind of a weapon to protect us, which sure. was awesome. Yeah. I think that's something two people don't realize is like, look, like, hey, he's hard, he beats us, but we know it's coming from a place of love and, and, and support. So yeah. it's not like it's a, it's a hate I, thing. I, I will be honest with you. I mean, obviously, I didn't, play, I didn't play in the league or play for like a Tom Coughlin or what have you, but I, I know a lot of guys that did, and I've talked to them like, Spurrier was not that difficult to play for. I mean, he was a very good, very much a player's coach. Okay. He, he, would, he would step up for you if you had a problem. He's just a good human being, and uh, obviously the ultimate bull gator in my opinion. So, yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I, I love that. Now, are you, are you kind of brought in to help recruit? Because I think that right there, like that entire segment of you talking about, hey, he helped develop me as a man. He helped create a yeah. – he was a player's coach. I know yeah. Bill is getting that a lot right now. Yeah, fortunately, we, we've tried to get more involved, my wife and I, um, with, with the new staff, the new program kind of since uh, since Billy took over and uh, the whole Gator Made program is very exciting for Gator Nation in my sure. opinion. Uh, what they're doing for the players as far as um, you know, teaching them life skills, opportunities to meet business leaders, opportunities to grow financially, et cetera, et cetera. Um, we're trying to get involved in that space to try to help some of these young men that you know, ultimately, uh, I had people pour into me to, to make me who I am today, and I want to be able to do the same, especially as a former student athlete, especially as a graduate from the university, uh, having a successful business. So all those blessings came from, from one place, and we want to be able to give back. I love that. that. That that gets overlooked time and time again of like how it helps. I mean, look, we all have our parents and we all grow and we learn a lot from them, but there's a, a separate level when you're able to go off to college and that's what it does. It builds you as a character, as a human, as an adult, and as a man. That's right. Um, and I think that's where that Gator made. I would love for it to be pushed more and more because it is a great program. I, I think it will be. I think ultimately uh, when you look at the NIL space, the, the true, you know, if you actually want to earn something for what you're doing, uh, from a charitable giving perspective, from, from working for a, whether it's a Habitat for Humanity or a St. Jude Hospital or a Shriners Hospital or whatever it may be, we may see more of that with some of the actual contracts that the players are going to sign connected to Gator Made and, and try to give them life skills while earning a very good salary sure. uh, to, to be the best person they can be, to be the f best future leader, best father, best husband, whatever it may be. Um, I'm very excited about that piece of it. Obviously, NIL can somewhat get turned a different direction when it's just pay someone to play. We'll see how all that shakes out. But uh, I think the plan that, that the staff has in place, and I have talked to them about this at length, is, is, a, is a good long, long plan. Long I know, uh, obviously, everyone focuses on the recruits and the five stars and this guy and that guy, whatever. Um, we're going to have a really good team. We're going to have really good character people. And ultimately, we'll get the level of, of talent that we need. I'm not worried about that at all. It's just we may have a different approach from some of our rivals. <laughs> I, I, I love the, uh, the, the underline there. I love that. <laughs> do, you, 